Hello, welcome. A few months ago, I published an Excel template which will help you create geographic heat maps for India where you have data at the state level. And you can find this blog post via the links I have under the solutions and Excel templates. Choose geographic heat map and that will take you to this blog post where you can download that Excel template. Since I published the template, I have received a few requests around how to change the color gradient on this heat map. So I decided to write an article about that. I have provided a link to that new article from this blog post at the bottom. And this article explains step by step how to change the color gradient. And now I'm going to demonstrate that in this video. So when you download the Excel template and open it, this is what it will look like. Now we're going to go to the con conditional formatting menu, choose manage rules, choose sheet data. You see the color gradient here that is currently in use. Click edit rule and you see the minimum and the maximum and the colors corresponding to that. If you want to change the minimum to any other color, so I'm going to choose green in this example and go to the maximum and choose another color. So I'm going to choose orange and I'm going to hit OK and hit another OK. And now for the final step, as you can see here, the color hasn't updated yet. Colors are still the old colors. I'm going to come to row number 40 and enter my new colors here. So the lowest was green and the highest would be orange. Now you can see as soon as I hit enter there or tab, the color colors on the heat map will update automatically. So I'm going to zoom back so that you can see the entire map here. And there you go. So now you have applied new colors or new color gradient to the heat map. You can go through the same steps again if you want to change the colors again. If you know conditional formatting in Excel, you can definitely play with that and change the colors according to your needs. If you have any more questions about this, please leave me a comment on my blog post. Thank you very much for watching this video.